Welcome back to the Blunt Exchange. Oh! Finally. Episode 25. 25. Yeah. My bad for last week. The snowstorm took us all kind of places. But we back. Woo! Yeah. Snow day, snow and day. to my left, I have the one, the only, Crump, a.k.a. Crump Diddy, a.k.a. My bad. Dexter. Nah, man. AKA Mail Vibes. Serial killer. Yeah, that's not cool, yo. Yeah. AKA Paper Over People. Wow. AKA William H. the All Time Great. How you doing, brother? Yeah. What's with the speed up at the end? Yeah. I'm chilling. I'm ju- I'm doing good. How was your week? All what are you AKA's. planning to do I don't this even weekend? Need this many AKAs, yo. I'll cut down a couple. AKAs. I'll cut down a couple. I think we should just cut out the Dexter and the serial killer. Dexter is my favorite. That, yeah, the, I'm not gonna lie to you. Dexter is my favorite. I mean, who cares what you like? I don't like it. That's that. That's that. And that. Yeah. Nah, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I had a I had a good week. Had a good week. Having looking forward to having another great weekend. The snow uh, this past week was a little trash, but you know. Yeah. yeah. Snow day. Snow day. It was snowing in the northeast, so you know. For y'all listening in California, watching in Florida, California. you don't know what this no, is I mean, about you don't at all. Know what it is. You have no idea what this is about. So yeah, you're good. Yeah. No plans yeah, for the yeah, weekend. Yeah. Uh, not right now. Okay. Get to the money. Okay. To, to the, the right. Money. I, got I have the one. Uh-huh. Uh huh. The wow. only. Yeah. Uh. Pablo. Yes. AKA. Uh. Bleak. Yes. AKA made by Pablo. Hey. hey. AKA DJ Wavy <laughs> Seal. <laughs> AKA, I'm not letting no pussy pass me. Nah. I got to smash it if it's in front of me because I'm that guy. Yes. Get your ticket. Grab them. Easy pass only. <laughs> Subscriptions is high. You did. OD, man. It was booming over snow day. Subscriptions is high. I was busy. Okay. Oh, You're shoveling. Working, You're doing heavy, sh- heavy, heavy shoveling, shoveling in the snow day. Oh, 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 I thought he was working on his only man's page. Oh, uh, <laughs> he got the only man's up? The only man's is rocking? Nah, nah, man, nah. Downloads is okay, okay, okay. You got some. You gonna hit them with it later. Yeah, got it in the store, and you know, hype. F- you you already know. I'm gonna wait for you to come back. And I am Aim Gunner, mm. aka Gregory Hines, the Great Dance Led John, aka tap 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 horsepower horsepower, Boom. aka low life, Boom. aka G U N N E R, the real gunner. Tap, tap, tap. Guys. Talk to me. What's good? Ain't shit, man. Stimulus, baby. We got the 600 coming. So it's not 1,200? Nah, bro. They played us. Stimulus money. They gave everybody your So let, yeah, give us some news. Stimulus money. How much are we getting for the stimulus? What's happening? What's agreed to? Is anything agreed to? What's going on? 600, bro. That's what we get. Well, $600 stimulus $600 as opposed we supposed to be getting as opposed week. to the 1200 we got last time. After that. Yes. Okay. You know. And is that it? Like what unemployment benefits extended to what? Like April or something March. like that? Something like that. March. Okay. And an extra 300 added An extra 300 a week for, for the continuing week? Is that retroactive? How does that work? No, Do you no, know? no retro. They're not, they didn't retro nothing. But going forward. 300 a week additional. Additional. The whole until, time for April? Until it ends in March. Wow. That's yes. not bad. But I mean, it could just, be better, but that's not bad. And the house th- hasn't signed it, but yeah, I think so. I think they will by the end of this. I Before think they the- agreed to the the three hundred extra dollars and the six hundred dollars stimulus. Yes. I don't know the actual details of when that goes into place, but it should start January. Well, no, no, last, I think they should this sign. Is the, this is the they're going to do it before Christmas. Basically, this is the last week or the second to last week of unemployment benefits. Yes. Right. So it would no, have no, to. It, it's already been extended. Yes. No, no, no. For the year, but if you had got it extended after the initial yes. unemployment payments. Uh huh. It ends next week or next week. Mm-hmm. This is this is the second to last week, and then it ends next week. Okay. So then January first, you'd be at January first going forward, you'd be out of out of yes. luck, shit out of luck. Mm-hmm. But now we have it extended to April, right? March. Shout out to y'all, whoever getting unemployment out there, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, people yeah, need the money. It's not enough, but you know. Make sure you do something with it this time, guys. Come on, yeah. please. Yeah, it was her, yeah don't, don't The be first like, time you had the big money, I don't know what you did with it. This time, please. So many people put it got away. We don't up. know what's so happening. So many people got locked up for like fraud, for like, you know, taking that money, taking that, what is that, that uh, that small business loan? Uh, yeah, yeah, the PPEs. Yes. Yeah, yeah, PPEs PPPs. and taking it and, uh, you know. They had to catch ultimately up. Ultimately, committed fraud and are probably getting prosecuted. But just do the right thing with the money. Speaking of fraud, you saw yeah. that back and forth between Omni and the Hellcat and yeah. G Herbo? Yeah. 
Oh my god, that shit's funny. You have any yeah. of the screenshots? You have the screenshots. Break it down for us, bro. What's going on with that? Omni and Omni the Hellcat is that man. He had, he had Nitro he popping, baby. He ultimately for my, for my fire stick niggas. You already him. know what it is. We man. need him. These are Yo, the type man, of hope... dudes that we need Woo. around. You know what I mean? We we, we respect you, we brother. Appreciate You're a legend your in the streets. Yeah, no, you we appreciate your work and what you do for the community. You think so? Yeah. And bringing this on on the heat. So they got into a back and forth. Omni and the Hellcat. Omni and the Hellcat. And No Limit uh, Herbo, which is G Herbo's yes. uh, tag. Mm -hmm. And I mean, the Hellcat says to G Herbo, I didn't get bagged for fraud, bro. I just didn't pay my taxes on time. Mm. Don't bring me into your shit because your shit is fucking hot. Oh, no. He said, he said, he said, oh, he, no. Yeah. They said uh, G Herbo was, um, was uh, pillow talking. They, they shared a girl and G Herbo was pillow, pillow talking. And oh, that's, wow. another one. And that's, another that's one. why I brought it up. Wow. But that's why I brought That's a back and forth you can go through with wow. you guys. It's, it's getting spicy, some spicy shit. Yeah. Um, oh, but it's two man. questions that arise from that and two ways, of, uh, two, two uh, ideas I had when I heard about this story. That's why we brought it up in the okay. first place. Wow. Talk to me, baby. One, Hit pillow with talking. It. We got to get okay. into that. Get okay. into pillow talking. Because that's the thing that a lot of dudes nap, do. Nap. And, bro, it's not the best, it's not the best move, bro. A you lot can't of just people tell fail people at the your pillow. business. You can't tell anybody your business like that, to be honest with you. You got to be very careful who you let in. It should, have, it should be some NDAs, or they should have something to lose, or you should have an envelope with all their secrets. Yeah. So, right. you know, you got to make sure you protect yourself. But uh, pillow talking is one thing I wanted to get into. Mm -hmm. And um, shitting on, like, remember uh, we had a, a topic about when your shorty, if she's, if she's the type of shorty to blast you online? Right. What about niggas that just talk reckless? Online and in public shit, uh, like when it regards to women or just in general. To you, like it's a dude, so it's dude, dude type of vibe. So it's like, oh, somebody had a problem about, with me. Oh shit, yeah, problem. Anything, but talk reckless about you do shit. Like, oh yeah, yeah, I used to, I used to slang with this nigga, b. Uh -huh. Easy, like easy talking. bragging, easy oh, bragging. About, oh yeah, yo, this nigga got yo. I was in and his crib it, last week. The nigga had like ten racks right mm -hmm. there on the table, nigga. I'm you already sure. know how we do. Oh, God. Thirty racks. Yeah, you, get you, it right. Yeah, when you got now we do. Yeah, thirty got, racks. Now we ain't no broke niggas. My nigga got thirty racks on him right now. What the fuck are you talking about? The dick, yo, wow. Oh, um, we do all the schemes, yo. We yeah, I don't. Our, I, I, our pieces is hitting, nigga. Yeah, I don't. I don't really. I don't mess with that. How do you yeah, handle that? I can't. How do I handle somebody talking reckless about me? I mean, on, online. But they have love for you, though. What do you mean they have love? If they have they, love, they, they have no love. They don't. They don't look at it as. Oh, they're just. They, they're like just talking. They're out trying their to mouth, big like you water up. Mouth. Yeah, yeah like, water like, mouth. Oh, okay. Yeah. So yeah, you just gotta like. I mean, spank them one time. Tell them we don't do that. Yeah. How you, how you go, how you go spank a water mouth when he's just yeah. trying to show you, like, yo, I'm just trying to show you love. Nah, like, you, you don't have to get... We like, gotta, do you know how it is nowadays? It's like gotta, DJ Vlad. You, gotta like, you don't got to get into details. Just say, yo, that's my man. Whew. He's the man. Oh, wow. That's, yo, shout out to my man. He's the man, yo. Execution. He held me down. We, we've, we've, we've gotten it in together. But when you get into details, then, you know what I mean? That's, you're just leaving yourself, yourself open. Huh? Yeah. Tell him on yourself. Anything to say about the dude water mouth? You gotta mouse? treat him like how Frank Lucas treated his own cousin. Put him, put his head under a piano. Yeah, <laughs> slamming We're spilling a blood times. on alpaca. You know what I mean? And then have him clean it up. Oh with my so, god! With, with, with fucking soda. With soda. You blot that shit. You block. You blot it. You, blot. <laughs> you feel me? You can't. Anybody? Pedal anybody seen Tenet? Yeah, I've seen Tenet. Of Tenet. course. Oh, that shit was fire. Od. So right, um, you gotta so do anyway. it. You gotta treat him like that if they pillow so, talking. But now the other uh, side of it in a partner. The pillow talking with a partner. Yeah. Do you, you, pillow, do. you pillow talk, Bleak? I don't pillow talk. I hug my pillow when I sleep. I don't talk to it. Mm. I hug it. What? Feel Crump, me? you ever you ever pillow talk? No. I'm a man. Listen. I'm a man. I'm a grown man. Yeah, I'm a man. real one. Does your shorty, have you ever had a female pillow talk with you? I mean, have you pillow talked in the past? Is that no. something you've done? No. Mm. I don't do so that. So what do you do when you're shorty at nighttime when you're not smashing? You don't talk about shit? I don't talk. I oh, sleep. Oh, shit. I sleep. Dexter. The dick. What do you do? Me? Yeah. <clears throat> you pillow I... talk? So, yo, G, um, when was the last time you pillow talked? I don't pillow talk. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I feel but that. if I was to ever, uh, you know, be laid up with a shorty talking, that would be mm -hmm. somebody that I would have, have trusted. We'd be in, a, like, a relationship that I know that I could trust her anyway. Mm -hmm. okay. So pillow our business is the same business. That's called pillow talking. And then that pillow talk would be acceptable. I feel like there is acceptable pillow talk. Oh, with your lady. With someone that you can trust. Not, oh, you know, oh, not a fly by be, night. It might, it might not be your lady, but somebody you can trust. Yeah. Uh, I yeah. mean, I would only be 
pillow talking with a female. I, I personally, I understand how you. I, I didn't I'm just mean making that. sure because the way. Yeah, okay. That. Let's just make sure we say it the right way. I don't get you in trouble. Pillow talking. You, you pillow talk, that's it. No matter what you do, if you pillow talk, you pillow talk. How do you know the female is a right female that you can pillow talk with? You, you don't pillow talk. So you don't tell your shorty you anything? Gotta, yo, did Michael Corleone tell his wife? Did he tell Kat that he oh. killed his own... That he killed so wait his a sister's husband? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Even when he told them, I'll tell you this one time, he still lied. We are supposed to... You don't We are supposed nothing. to advocate for having the best relationships possible. Yeah, so what pillow talking... Would there ever be a situation... Because, you know, pillow talking is looking as, looked at as a negative. I feel like we have right. to define pillow talking for real so we don't confuse pillow talking with something else yeah. and we know what not to do in terms of pillow talking. So, for example, no, I don't I, think pillow talking is sharing, you know, going over your day or what you went through or what your plans to do or yeah. your goals with your lady or no, a woman no, no, that no, you no. can trust. Well, that's not pillow talk. talking. So I don't no, do no. pillow talk. So if that's the case. I don't do pillow talking. I converse with my lady when it comes to, like, me talking about my day or, or, or anything that we have going on. But when it comes to, I, I think pillow talking is something that that is a negative thing that happens with people that you wind up, you, re, you realize afterwards that you shouldn't have been talking to that person because you can't trust mm -hmm. that person. Mm -hmm. So pillow talking, I feel, in general, is a negative thing mm -hmm. because if you're, it's not pillow talking, it's just talking with your, with your, with your, Either significant, which are significant other, or the person that you're interacting with at the time. But I mean, like, I think just the connotation of pillow talk is a negative thing. Like that person wanted up going back and talk, talking about what you told them. Hmm. What do you think, Bleak? Yeah, man, pillow talk is uh, yeah, it's dicey, right? Mm -hmm. Cause you obviously you express something to someone that you either liked or you didn't like, right? It was kind of personal. You Definitely told them. Definitely personal. And then they fucked up and they split the beans. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you can't trust that person. And then you're an asshole for thinking like how, whatever you said. So you just have to choose. Oh, just choose wisely. Yeah, choose wisely who choose you talk wisely to. Choose wisely who you talk so to. So let's define real quick. So what is pillow talking? Just telling it to the wrong person? So like, I, I, actually, is pillow talking just like a, is it the, the after effect? Yeah. Or is it talking to anyone? I mean, do you, what what is your what is your? I think that you have to talk like any healthy relationship. You're gonna like, have to have conversations yeah. and tell them what you're going through. What yes. the actual your your partner should know the truth about what's going. on. I guess on. that's what that's pillow talk. I guess. I mean, and it, that would be considered pillow talk technically, yeah, no, right? I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I mean, technically, yes, but it's not. I don't feel it's in the same realm as it's just how it's commonly referred. Like when people refer to pillow talking, that means you normally, made the wrong decision. You made the wrong decision. You told the wrong person some mm. personal wait, wait, stuff. Wait, 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 wait. But that's if you look at it in the negative way. They usually when you when they say you pillow talk, it's sometimes negative. Like like you said, Jay, right? Mm -hmm. it's the negative. So it's got to be that you said something wrong, or you expressed something, or you about went someone, too far. You or you, or you just yeah, told you somebody, somebody too much you information. Told somebody too much. information that you weren't supposed because to. you could either because be, you're laid up in bed because your your senses no, are impaired no, 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 or whatever. No, I, I'm, 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 but you could yeah. either be snitching by telling somebody secrets, or you could be telling something about yourself. That's what I'm saying. So yeah. like basically, so it seems like the way that we use it in everyday language, it's basically that you messed up. Pillow talking is you're fucked up. Only if Because you, you told the wrong person. Only if Because you talking to your negative. bitch, is that pillow talking? Technically, yes. But negative, now I don't see yes. nothing wrong with that. You should, then you should pillow talk. I'm sorry. So there's a good and positive pillow talking, guys. There is. To be a, honest with you. There is a good and a positive. So there's good and, and negative right. pillow talking. There's nothing wrong with pillow talking with the right person. I mean, I, I just think it's talking. You agree, if, disagree? If, if, if you're talking to the right person, it's just talking. But you're in bed late up after sex, with during sex. I mean, you're talking after, about like, that kind of stuff. And like, it normally happens with people you shouldn't because you, you're in a place of vulnerability after and having sex. And intimacy. And intimacy. And then usually that but, should be with somebody But if you're, you, if, you're, if, you're, if, you're, if you're talking about talking to somebody that you're in a consistent relationship with it or something like that, like that it's just talking through it might it might happen right after sex but it could just be happening throughout the time but normally with the people that you shouldn't be doing with it's you it's because like when you're just hanging out you know you're on your guards but after a vulnerable sex kind of thing you just feel a little more open up but i'm trying to like i get that and that's and that's yeah that's good but it's also the information right that you're giving up so to me when it's when they say it's negative it's because you obviously said something like fucked up mm-hmm Right? Or you snitched on someone. So I would say hit us up in the comments for that one. Um, let us know what's pillow talking, what isn't pillow talking. Did we get it right? Should you pillow talk? Because I feel like you have to... Way of what kind of relationship can you have that's a healthy relationship that you don't talk to each other? 
Like that shit sounds crazy. Like that shit sounds crazy. So I need the real definition of right. pillow talk. Pillow talk versus gossip. Hit us up in the comments. Let us know what pillow talk means. How about that one? Hey guys, we uh we went crazy with the pillow talk. It sounded it was it was fun, but we got to go back to word of the day. We got to stick to our routine. Word of the day. <laughs> word of the day. Word of the day. Word of the day. All right, word of the day. Sheesh. We need the, we need some fucking soundboard or some shit, bro. We got this. Lit. It's fire. I, I respect it. Let's get All it. All right. So the word of the day today is an easy one. Okay. Oh. That's what you say every time, G. Yeah, because I'll be giving you. you words that you guys know subliminally. But I trust just, you. Let's all right, here we go. Word of the day. Mm. Easy. Ah. If you don't know this one, I feel door. bad for you. Door. <laughs> <laughs> but what is a door? What is a door? It's, it's, it's. <laughs> all right. Uh, the word of the day is nemesis. Oh. Come on. An enemy. Okay. What do you think? Uh, Someone of, of opposite of you. Like a, like a. <laughs> Yeah, like good. I hear a character from Resident Evil in the background. Nemesis. I get, I get it. Yeah, I get the reference. Evil. Uh, your evil you counterpart. Enemy? You say enemy. Ooh, a like nemesis is your like evil a counterpart. Like, yeah, like your, your yeah. Evil, your evil counterpart. Yeah, like the, the 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 villain to you. If you're the hero, your villain, the person who's okay. always at your opposition. Well, guys, it's a noun, and I would say if you know if I had to grade, you guys both got it right. The definition for nemesis is the in, inescapable agent of someone's or something's downfall. A le, or another definition is an, a long-standing rival or an mm-hmm. arch enemy. An arch enemy. All right? Enemy. Nemesis. So We didn't yeah. say this before, but yo. Use this in, the, in your daily... Uh, Happy, uh, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas? This is a Christmas yeah. episode. It is Merry Christmas? Christmas? It is a Christmas it episode. It is the Christmas episode. Comes Can you out. say that nowadays? Yeah. Are I'm you allowed say, to say I'm that? Saying it. Man, Are you I'm allowed saying to say it? it? This is America. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas, man. Happy holidays, everybody. Oh. oh. Okay, this Merry is... Merry Christmas. Can we get into this? No, no man. No, we're not Why can't we get into it? Because I was joking. Keep it. No, no, we out. No, no, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, go ahead. What's wrong with saying happy holidays if it's not What's wrong with saying Merry Christmas? Nothing. But what's wrong with saying happy holidays? Why can't you get offended if I say happy holidays? Because y'all don't want me to say Merry Christmas. Christmas is a holiday. It is. So why not say Christmas? Christmas is a holiday. So let's say Merry Christmas. All right, move on. Let's go. All right. Mm-hmm. Nobody's Christian, but I'm saying like even if you're a Christian, I'm a Christian. This is America. I don't feel offended by saying Happy so Holidays. That... I don't say her name. Say his name. Oh. <laughs> say Christmas. Say, say his name. Say it. Like you know what I mean? Like, like Jesus, Jesus. Yeah. Christ, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Let's get it. And Happy Holidays. <laughs> um, one hundred. Only on the blood exchange. Only. Um, so guys, let's get into some of these topics that we have for the week. We oh, can't do man. power talk once again. Yo, Bleak, you gotta like you should be able you should Listen. have to do like shots or some shit. Listen, man. You owe us something next week. You gotta you have to bring something. Next week. Don't put this on me. Next week, before it's, we it's get into video power video talk, piece. you All have right. to give us a, a synopsis of power up to that point. Okay. Oh, you you don't want that. Really? And the right names. Right. No Maria's. Paula. Alright, no Paula. No, no, no Paula's. No Stephanie's. Damn, all right. All right, I got you. All right? I got you. So power talk next week. What's next? Top of the top Yo, of the list. top. The top baby. of the list. Let's go. Bleak, I feel like you went crazy behind the scenes. I want you to. What you mean? I want you to Take jump the into the first one. You yeah. So me? yeah, sure. we just you know I want the lighter, man. I'm freaking Can out. We get a lighter? I haven't been in a lighter blunt. Jesus my nigga. Christ! This is a blunt exchange. The Where fuck? is our lighter? We had a black lighter. It's gone. How the did other that and a blue one too. It's probably my fault somehow. Okay. That's my lighter. What the fuck? It was over there. Gee, um, I wanted to piggyback a little bit from last week when we talked when we talked about like the 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 currency and the traits mm-hmm. and women and all that. But like you know when you always because I've heard this a lot yeah. and I've been told this too. Like you never be in a relationship where you know you where you love the most. Yeah, yeah. I've definitely you gotta heard be that. with somebody that loves you. Just a little. You bit can't more. be the person that's it in can't love be really the most. Fifty fifty because you're gonna lose. Yeah, you're the one that's gonna break your boundaries or yeah. break your rules or like, or bend or cave, and the other person you're always playing catch up to like when the other person's you know, when you're in love the most you're gonna be trying to catch up. That's what they say, man. Like, how do you feel about that? I mean, because this it sounds harsh, right? Doesn't it sound harsh? Nah, but to say I get it. With someone that in loves every you more in every dynamic, them, there's always gonna be harsh. there's always gonna be like an alpha. It can't be 42, 49. You can't just say that. Yeah, yeah, but someone's always 52, gonna have to 49, be. I'm sorry. You can't. Two people can't lead the same thing. Like someone's always gonna be. Someone's always gotta yeah, compromise just a little be, more. Yeah, someone's gotta be in power. Someone's always mm. gotta be the powerful. So there's gotta be a chain of command. Yeah, always, no matter what. Sheesh. You agree with that? 
I, I, I feel that um, if that is something that is, if, if I, I don't necessarily agree with that. Um, okay. Yeah. Uh, I think I think there's going to be times where one person loves the other person more, and vice versa. Especially if it's a long term relationship. I think. Mm-hmm. So, what are you saying? Do you think? Do you are you saying that it's possible think, to love each other the same? No, I'm saying I'm saying that if it might it seem like right now you might be the person that might be loving more uh, a little bit harder, that doesn't mean that you're doomed in this relationship. I think. I think real relationships go through ups and downs and 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 here's and there's and yeah. um, ebbs and flows. Ebbs, ebbs and, flows. and flows. So there there might be a time where I might be loving you a little like I might be loving you a little bit more yes. during this time. And then and another time she might be I might loving be a little, me a little burnt bit more. out. Mm-hmm. But I think the thing is that whoever has the quote unquote who, who whoever's whoever's the Whoever's the person who's not loving as hard, if they notice that and then they act on that to like to take to, advantage, to take of advantage, it? I think that's where the negative part. But then, comes then, out. then is that even really love wow. at that point? If you're taking advantage of somebody that no. loves you, no, like that's not really love, is that? What well, is that's that? taking advantage of someone that loves you. <coughs> yeah, and yeah. I like that crumb because it's true. Like a relationship does have highs, yeah. you know, and lows, and it's about that. So once you can. Uh, I feel like once you can see that in a relationship, once you're able to, like, comprehend that between both parties, mm-hmm. you might be able to, like, just keep it a, keep it a level, no, keep it a flow, like, and understand right. that that's what happens. It I might just be think, burnt out. I just think a, a true, like, a, one, of the, a, a, one of the ways to, to tell if somebody really loves you or, like, they're going into the relationship with the positive intentions, the right intentions, is if they are the person yeah. that loves the less. Like, you're, they're the, you know, they're, they have the power in the dynamic, right? And they don't use it to take advantage. They actually, you know, like re- reassure and, and reciprocate. reciprocate. Yeah, like to make them feel loved. Like you know what I mean? Like yes. you know, I know, Very like much. I know that you're thirst, but you know, it's all right. You feel me? So um, I think that would be a, that's a great sign for that. And if if you're you know if you have somebody's the power has the power in the dynamic, and at the same point in time they're taking advantage of it, they're getting all the presents, they're getting all the time. They get whatever they want to, then the relationship ain't right anyway. So wow, some funny's true. happening that's so anyway. True. That's so true. Yeah. But I, I, what one of the one of the um, key things that um, that I think everybody needs to just keep in mind is just that, like, just because you might have a particular role at the time doesn't mean that that's what it is forever. Yeah, and if it is that forever, role, yeah. and if it is that forever, then you need to you you might want to reconsider that relationship because. Some somebody, you can't. Somebody's like one person can't always be the the motivator or the yes. energy That's for, that burns for you out. That's what burns you out. You're gonna burn them out. You're gonna burn yourself out, man. Mm-hmm. Fast, you burn so. yourself out. That's what happens. Yeah. That's what that's the. I feel like that's what. So you take chances. The ups you and take downs. you take um you take uh uh, uh turns. Right. You know, carrying. Mm-hmm. Or you do. You do. Down or yeah. being the strength or whatever. That, you know, whatever your the dynamic of and the And you also is. take different roles as you grow in a relationship. Of like course. Each other, you know, you start to see it. And to be honest with you, if you know that someone loves you more than you love them, you got to go even harder. And that's To only, show them that you still, you And know then I mean? that's only going to make them love you even more. So it's like... It's you know, good. It's always, it keeps it you on the, positive. Yeah, it should be positive because it keeps, you, keeps the party at, at their toes. Okay. Look at us. Huh? Look at us on the blunt exchange. Wow. Who would have thought we'd have got got Look to this man. kind of point, guys? I mean, Listen, man, we gotta keep it blunt. I think I think I think I think the people like this. We gotta keep it blunt like this with better? this shit, though. I think, uh, like, yeah, I think I think they I think they appreciate. I, don't know. This. I think I like the salacious shit, man. I don't know. I think they appreciate. I think they appreciate some real. Can stuff. Can we get into some shits later? A little yeah, bit yeah, more yeah, shits. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just like, come on, man. You shits, right? Uh, they're bugging, right? Yeah. Shits. All right, come on. What else we got? Yeah, it's like it's left, like left don't want the shits. Yeah, <laughs> he likes real talk. I mean, what do you do when a sh- you ever you guys ever been with a shorty that wants an open relationship? No, I've never, I've never, I'm, I'm haven't. You haven't? No. <laughs> you? Oh man! All right. She could so she so manage it right. Have, right. have you? Have you? Have, have you? Come on, bro. Oh, of, why oh, you gonna ask me questions you know the answer to? Of course, yeah. yeah. But listen. Oh wow. Well, open well, relationships. Wow, way to say that. You keep Open relationships keep are tricky as shit, guys. Give me one second. Very, very Let me get much blunt. So. <laughs> nah, it does. It has to be. Shit is listen, insane. When you have, listen, a relationship, a, re- a regular relationship is tough as shit. Yeah. Because you're de- dealing with two personalities. Mm-hmm. Two, you know, if, it's, if it was me, it's two oh, one strong personality. personalities. Too strong. Really? Now imagine you're talking a, about from your side, from your point of view, you're dealing with one person. You're dealing I, with one strong personality. No, but two personalities. I like, mean, you're not you're not dealing with yourself. 
I don't mean to be grime or the pedantic. relationship. I'm not trying to be pedantic. The relationship is two persons. Okay, okay, okay. You're talking about to oh, I'm sorry, work I'm together. Sorry. Yes, I'm, I'm, is that? I understand. Yeah, I understand, I understand, I understand. Okay. Yeah. So two personalities going together. That in itself is tough as shit. Right, I agree. Now add another one. Wow. Three personalities trying to make one relationship. It's three it's tough. of them, Captain. Yeah. It's tough. It's we not got three, easy. three, Captain. And then not to mention, it, it's possible, but it's you almost need like perfect, like a perfect oh, scenario. Need, like you need Stevie Wonder. You need like you need. You need your, your yeah, the yeah, females, yeah. or I mean, I would assume for me personally, if I was to be in a relationship with two other people, it'd be two other females. Yeah, I was about personally, to say. Uh-huh. but you know, there's so many if different she, combinations. If she, wanted, that work. if she wanted to be in, if she wanted to be open to have with another guy, you would would you be down? Um, you see, like the way you the way you word it. What if he was like he he didn't live in the oh, state. Wow. He lived he lived out of he lived across the country, but and when, it's an open relationship. It's right? open. When, so but when I he, never see him. Right. That's the only other shorty. That's the only other nigga she smashes, mm-hmm. and I'm free to do whatever I want. Yes. Right. I can do that. That's it's not a does, bad role. Does, does, does it have? That's to, not a bad role. Is, is, is it better that he and lives far away? All the cards are face up. Let me, let me ask you this. Is that's that, all. That's all I ask for. Let me let me ask you this. Is it better that? Is it is it better? If he doesn't live local, could you do it if he if he lived down the block from you? See, this is my problem. This is my issue with, with open relationships, and this okay. is why all my open relationships and and I'm, and I'm not and, trying to just jump on you with a, with a million questions. And all that shit, all that shit fucked up because of this. Mm-hmm. To me, in the end, it's fun at first physically, uh-huh. yeah. But in the end, if it doesn't work financially, it's it's even it's a like imagine so having to support two to shorties. This. Yeah, I wouldn't want to do it. Imagine having to like buy the toilet paper or the milk or the bread. It's a whole nother shorty in the crib. It's like having a kid, but a grown ass kid. Just imagine another person just soaking up the resources, time, anything. Imagine how the sex is. I've done it. So, it but imagine it. Like, think about it. But wouldn't it be better if it was, if it was, an, if it happened to be another dude, it wouldn't be double the money. Like, I understand if you had two girls, that would be, like, if you had two consistent girlfriends, I understand how that would be no, because a women, lot, a women, lot of money. Okay, on but if the it was, women earn a lot more than us nowadays. Black women are, like, the highest earning, like, people in the country. I mean, don't they still, I, I believe they still are on a pay, they still make less than white men. I mean, <laughs> like, <laughs> everything added, like, of course, but I'm saying, like, and less like if you want to single they, out they the demographics, make, they still wow. make less than they're the highest educated and the highest earning people in the United States. Black women. Black women. Co- yeah, collectively. Like, but, but on an individual basis, yeah, like, yeah, their of course. jobs. Are, like, yeah. I, just wanted st- I just still wanted to state that, yeah. that like, still, mm-hmm. like, they still there's get a, 70 a cents huge on a dollar. Dispar- oh, yeah, 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 okay, yeah. there's a huge, huge. Wealth, wealth disparity, and it's huge. fucked up, and we're always against that shit. You're the woman, 2020. Um, <laughs> yes. <laughs> we don't need to keep saying that. Yes, Why we not? Do. We love women. 2020. I mean, we don't... <laughs> But I'm not trying to say that women are broke or anything. I'm just trying to say, as a man, sometimes you feel like you have to hold it down right. yeah. for, uh, you know, your woman. You know, put exactly. a little bit more in, make sure she knows that you got her. Yeah, right. You know what I mean? So just imagine world. having to support that, that mental support. The sex gets tricky because what if she works at night or she comes in and she's tired and, mm-hmm. and sometimes, oh, well, I don't you want you to be just sexing her when... I'm sleeping or at work. You guys are laid up, sexing. She doesn't work no more, mm-hmm. or like you know, what I mean? it, it, it's all, she's off for a week. So you guys are just going on trips and shit. I'm at work all day. Like yeah. it gets crazy. Yeah. Do you think that's something that you could pull off? Is that something in another life that you would be <clears throat> interested in? I feel like, uh, like, what do you think? What are your thoughts on it? <laughs> another life, yes, I would be very interested. Okay. Um, but in the one I live in today, mm-hmm. I haven't pulled it off. So, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I, I gave up on the dream on that. But. Damn, you should never give up on your dreams. Nah, yeah, you're right. But Never give a, up on your dreams. Yeah, that's the one. I'm okay with that, giving that one up. Because, like Crumb said, it is difficult to handle. I just don't want to. I know I have, like. It, I, it just. It sounds cool. And, like, my cool, good friend says, you got to be but rich. It's just, it just, what do you I mean it just, sounds cool? If it's done right, think about it. It's three incomes. It's oh, always someone so there to be with you. Not yes. open re- so I feel you're describing yeah, a throuple. Okay, not you know open what? Re- my bad. I'm living. I'm living like like actual life experiences. So I, I guess I, I was too attached to the way the question was asked from the beginning. Let me just just open relationship. I, mean, I feel you, like uh, I can handle an open relationship, but it's just got to be everything's got to be out in the open. Yeah, I but who know chooses the, the partner? exact parameters? Yeah, I we, I need to know you who the partner, the partner is. I, I don't have to choose it. 
I mean, I just got to know who it is another, you obviously and what it is. Another woman, because another question I had a uh, 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 my boy asked, uh-huh. what he said, they said, how could, if, if an open relationship, if there was an open relationship, could you deal with the fact that she was like, had some strong ass feelings for this nigga? Like she's going, it's not just fucking, like sometimes she's over there, she goes chill with his parents or like, mm. you know, she's mad cool with his kid or whatever, you know what I mean, type um, shit. Are they in a relationship? Yeah, that's weird. Yes, because yeah. you're in a relationship as well weird. with her. Uh-huh. It's an open relationship. Could you deal with that? Nah, I wouldn't. No, no, no. I couldn't deal with. I couldn't deal with somebody I was putting in my time and energy and emotion. But she's into. also putting her time and energy and emotion into you. She's yeah. not slacking or shortchanging nah, you. I just you. don't want her giving anything to anybody else. Okay, so you're selfish with it. Yeah, you would not. You could not share a woman. Yeah, no, I don't want to share a woman. Not even for a night. Never. Okay. That's and then bleak. No, I'm, I want to ask you how do you how do you choose the partner? How do you choose the? Because obviously you're going to choose a woman, correct? Right? It'll be two women and you. It, to me, if I was an open relationship, but there's some girls that want another. But dude. I don't want two dudes in a. I mean, she could have another dude. Just I just in the same household. Nah, I don't. You said I can't do that. I'm thinking like you mean in the. Yeah, same yeah. Household. I'm used to the. Th- I'm used to the, the the open relationship is basically a throuple, uh-huh. and I I conflated two different. Okay. Topics. This is a completely different topic. It's just open relationship. She could do whatever she wants. I could yeah. do whatever I want. Oh, okay, okay. If I'm going to do whatever I want, she's going to do whatever I want. It still has got to be some parameters and some rules to that. Mm-hmm. And I would prefer if during that whole situation, I know who it is, when it is, where it is. And, you know what I mean? So I'm just comfortable. Do you, do you feel that you have, like, okay. do you feel you have the ability to ultimately veto anybody that... Let's say she's like, I'm on, I'm, I'm on, I started dating this guy also, or I'm, yeah. I'm going out with this person also now, See, and you don't fuck with him, not because y'all have real beef, you just don't like the kind of person that he is. Do you feel you have the authority in an open relationship to tell a shorty, okay, you ultimately don't want her to deal with a particular person because I think you have to, whatever personal reasons you have for it, All right. Hopefully you fuck with this answer. Oh. It's gonna sound like a little. Like, I think you. It's have gonna it. sound like I know y'all niggas call it Greg Rehans, but just tap, tap, tap. walk with me for tap, a second. Tap tap. If I'm in an open relationship with a shorty, off jump from the off beginning, jump. let's go baseline. Mm-hmm. Like I fucks with her that heavy that I'm willing to let her do what she wants because I feel like she needs that. Like I'm not trying to control you, but I don't. I'm not. You know what I mean? Where you're not. Go- you know what I mean? I'm not. I can't control you. You're your own person, of course. But you know what I mean? I'm okay with it because. I feel you that crazy. Okay. So that's already, in my mind, if I'm doing an open relationship and she's fucking other niggas, I already feel like I fucked with her that heavy. So follow that already. Mm-hmm. If she's fucking with niggas and I fuck with her that heavy, I feel like I should have the right to at least be like, yo, to I don't choose? fuck with that. Mm. She should be able to come to me like, yo, I'm going to let this nigga smash or like I f- I'm feeling this nigga or whatever it is. However she says that shit. She should be able to be like, she should be like running that, not running it by me. Like, yeah, she, she should have the respect. She, she should have the respect to communicate that to me. Like, yo, listen, you know, we, you know, I'm making sure we're safe. I'm just letting you know. Not him. How do you feel? Not him. Because if you feel some kind of way, I don't want, our shit is so crazy. I don't want to fuck that shit up. But if but that nigga has him. just as much pull as me, I couldn't do it. Like if it's an equal pull, yeah. I couldn't do but it. But if it's not equal pull, it's just. She just fucks with him and... Well, know, he's like, like dicking her down better than me or some shit like that. I'm going to automatically think that. Like, why are you yeah. so thirst for his dick? You don't even care about him? It's just dick? What the yeah. fuck is going what on? What do you think about... Just on that, like you said, you had to choose, right? Like, yeah. I have to choose the dude. Like, what do you think about... No, I don't have to choose him. I just want to have like a, a, a say-so. I want to say-so. But you know what I mean? I want to be consulted. It. And if she goes against it, then you just have do to you, deal with it. What if she says you right? have to, to be, deal with it? There's nothing you can do. And you're cool with her consulting on all the girls you want to deal with. Yeah, but like the way I move, I won't even move. No, stupid. It's, no, it's not about what how you feel. She wants. To I will be definitely bring her in for every every single one. Of course, okay. of course, of course. I, I mean, mean, that's equal. Yeah, I mean, like if you if you want to be able to be asked for every single if you want if you want her yeah, to run through every guy. You got to be able to... Um, that was too much. I would prefer that. It's just like, I like the I like the feeling of everything is open and it's on the table and we know what it is. Like, I know who you are. I know, like, your whack shit. I know it. Like, you know what I mean? All that little funny shit that you don't want anyone to know about, I know that shit. Like, I feel comfortable like that. Yeah. 
You know what I mean? Uh-huh. So I'd rather just be able to be like, yo, I want to fuck this bitch. Like, oh my God. Like, she's fire. What you think? I'm already what scouting if, her with you. Like, yo, together? Nah, okay. What if she's then like, I want to do what it. What if she's like, nah, I don't, I don't fuck with her? Then that's fair. Like, she, she can say what she wants to. I'm still living my life, and then we see what happens from there. We're in an open relationship. Yeah. You feel me? Just like you. Compromise. I'm right? going to say what I want to no say, and at the end, no you're going to do whatever you want to do in the end. You know what I mean? Let's go with it. No matter what, no matter anything, you still have to compromise. All right, you know what's crazy? This is a question from a viewer, female viewer. Shout out to you. I'm going to start mentioning names when I get more comments. What the fuck is going on? But you know who you are. Yes. Um, she asked, uh. this is a question that she wanted to ask dudes. Okay. Why is it that all the same outfits and dresses and shit that they put on that attracted you to them, that made you bag them, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. When y'all together or you have them, okay. you don't want them dressing like that. Get out of here with that skanky shit. What is that about? I don't know. I just said that because this is true. You couldn't wear that shit. I'm not a fan of overly <laughs> skanky outfits. I didn't say anything. Don't try to do that. Don't do that. So I'm just saying the way that you, the way that they dressed when you bagged, when you were attracted to them and you were on the chase, you don't want them to dress like that anymore. Why is that? They kind of went back to deal with. Put them at work. Hmm? Like I'm just, I will say that in my lifetime, I haven't dealt with anybody that I've asked them to stop dressing that way. Once I started dealing with them, I've approved the way that they dressed and encouraged the way that they dressed after. They've been bagged by me. Okay, they well, could still they could still wear what they want. Whatever they, could, they want, they could have still wore what they want what they were wearing beforehand. Okay, all right. Wow. Okay. Okay. Blink? That's just me. Um, you have to go through the tier of women, right? Because if wait, where did you meet her at the club? Women come in, women come in tears. I mean, yeah, because if you met her at the club, you know what she was wearing, right? She was wearing some shit that you're probably not gonna like her to wear after you bag. But if you met her but at then work, why would you try to bag her? You know what I mean? If you that. met her at work, you feel me? She might have to work attire, so them little tight slags. You know what I mean? She always gotta wear that. That's but feel me, like, what if you met her? At, what if you met her at a fucking festival and she only she had the crop top and short shorts? Yeah, you wanted to and wear you that, loved that four years in. She likes that. That's what she wears on a nice summer evening. You, that's your that's your girl though. What are you? What, are you? Oh, all right. So you at the what's park wrong by with you? Yeah, by, by yourself at the park. Oh, sometimes she goes to read a book in the park and she wears the crop and she, top and the short shorts. Oh, nah, I got the. She always did that. Droid. That's why you used to pull up on nah, her. You see, I got this. That's droid. what she does. Nah, I got the droid. When they wear shit like that, you gotta have them little droids. Okay. That follow her with the camera with straight, the camera to, straight okay. to your phone. Fuck that's out little, of here. It's a little creepy. But I feel but you do that. You gotta protect. First Amendment. You I respect protect. it. You protect and you why, serve. Why? Do, why do you, you tell do the women that, that they can't wear that anymore? You protect and you serve them. Pardon me. Why do you tell the women that they can't wear what they used to wear? I, I don't know if you're trying this new thing called loaded questions. Loaded. <laughs> boom. Boom. That question is boom. disingenuous. I don't do that. Uh, well, you. So why would you ask like me like that? that? I'm asking you what you do and uh, just going off what you do. Uh, Personally, I uh, I like a certain style of dress. And the style of dress that I like, if yeah. you continue wearing dressing like that, I okay. have no problem. Oh wow. This yeah. is me personally. I, I would never yeah. stop you from, you know, do your thing. That's me. That. If I if I if I approached you, I would have no problem with you wearing that if we were together. And that's oh, okay, 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 okay. Crump just he's, what he's trying to say is that he wouldn't approach a girl. That wears anything scantily. Short shorts. You don't like the, the crop That's top not, and the top. So you don't got to bother with that. Yeah, so I don't got to bother so with So your it. girl would never wear a crop top and short shorts. I mean, I wouldn't. No, I'm saying nothing that she wears, I'm going to say is too risque now because you're with me. That's what I'm saying. Would you go to a nude beach? No. What? Would you go to a nude yes. beach? Yes. Yes. Would you most go to a nude beach with your shorty? got to take chances. are old people. Would you go to a nude beach with your shorty? I don't I don't know. Would you go to a nude beach with your shorty? Yes, you got to take chances. Are you, you going to? Know. Are you going to a nude beach? Fuck Why not? That shit is gonna be fire. fun as shit. Why you, not? You know, man. You going to a nude? You got to sacrifice yeah, that shit at is all. Lit. You go, <laughs> you got to sacrifice at all. Ask. ask it, bro. It's your show. Going, <laughs> we can cut it out. It doesn't matter. I want to hear the reactions. You going to the nude beach with your niggas <laughs> to go back, bitches? <laughs> to go back, bitches? <laughs> Yo, imagine having to go to a nude beach imagine sh- with your niggas to try to bag bitches. Yeah, sh- that pull- is a crazy, yo, sick-ass yo, car ride, bro. Short, you pull up to the gas station. You pull up to the gas station. You know what? You pull up to the gas station. You pull up to the gas station. You pull up to the gas station. There's like four shorties. And they're like, and it's you and your dudes? Yo, where y'all going? We going to the nude beach. Y'all should pull up. 
Yo, we out? We Listen. out? What Listen. you doing? Separate cause. Listen. Yo, we out? I'm telling y'all. And it'd be even worse, like, if you come to, like, a... It'd be even worse. It'd be even worse if you come up to, like, a gate before you get to there. And they're like, all right, guys, from this point uh, only, it's bottom, nude. Bottoms And off. then you drive another mile to your beach. Yeah. So, yeah. But this is a nude beach. From yeah. now on, it's nude, guys. Come on. You got to walk to the shit. They're, like, 200 yards away. Even in the car, they're going to be watching you, so... I mean... If you got the right wolf pack, it could be done. And it could be a glorious you, time. Are you are you, not, I'm, I'm, are you out... Once there's more than one person in the car for the nude beach? I'm probably not trying to... I'm not pulling up to the to bag the shorties at the nude beach with my dudes. This is, uh, you're I'm, not doing it? I'm not Spur of the it. moment on vacation? Yeah, I fall in some other joints. If we're in the... Jesus if we're in the, Christ. Yeah. But do you like... Not, are you... Do you like being naked? What's going on? What's going on right now? Stop. Yo, Look left. these loaded What's questions. Right now, left? What's happening, man? Do you like being Talk naked? To us. Talk to are you are you pulling up? Are you pulling up? To the, I said I'm already going to no, the nude beach. No, no, with your dudes. He did say that. Are you walking are you with, your with your dudes? A hundred well, yards to I go see the, the shorty. Whoa, what was it? Wasn't walking no, hundred yards. No, no, you pull, up, you pull up to the beach. No, you pull, drive, you pull up to the, the beach. Yeah. From this point on, it's walking only, and it's a nude beach. And shorties are a hundred yards down the beach. There's a, there's a short shorties. No, the shorties that you just yeah, bagged at the gas station. Yeah, they're short, right? What so do you mean, why are we not focused about going to get the shorties? I don't yeah. understand the problem. Everybody's so it's focused. yes. Nobody is so you're, some, so you're, so you're, so yeah. So nobody's it's yes. on some funny shit. So it's yes. Yes. So, uh, so it's yes. Set, are the I'm parameters yes, set? Are, so it's yeah. What do you mean? It's, so it's yeah. You sounded mad. You sounded mad they, confident two seconds ago. I sound confident right now. Why All right. So are you pulling up? I said, are you getting? If are you joint, in your, I don't see the problem in going to bag joints with your dudes. So yeah, you should What's have no problem? problem saying, "Yeah, I'm I'm going but, with my dudes to the nude beach." I said I have no shorties. problem going with my guys uh -huh. to go bag shorties at a nude beach. Fire. Even if I have to get naked with them. Let's get it. Fire. That's what's up. I'm telling you, right? you with the right wolf no, pack. Because, it be because done, none man. of my it dudes be with the right wolf pack. are interested it could be done. in dudes. Yeah. No, obviously. And I feel comfortable about that. I mean, obviously. And I know yeah. we'll be focused on the prize. Yes. Right, right. And 100%. It'll be fun at what if, she, what if that, what, you, get, you, pull up, you pull up to the shorties, right? Uh, macking on them. And I'm hanging already. And they're like, yo, let's play volleyball. They're like, yo, there's a volleyball net. Let's play volleyball. I'm not playing play frisbee. Games. I'm chilling in Let's the hammock. With, I'm chilling in the hammock with my assigned. Nah, there's shorty. no hammock. We're just on the beach. With the shorty the that I've seeked out, I'm playing like you know. Yeah. I'm chilling with her. What if she's like, yo, I, we just we're getting we, we're, we're just getting to know each other. Let's just play a game. Let's, uh, Let's go play, play a volleyball. game of where we talk to each other by ourselves. Let's play that game. No, nah, I don't. I don't. I don't. She's like, I don't. I don't want to go away with you right now. Okay, so let's do it right here. Bet. Nice, even better. What's up? Yeah, let's yeah, just talk man. right now. We hang, that's oh, what we told her. That's so the first thing I'll go tell anywhere. her. <laughs> Yo, let's go hang out. But I'm not doing whatever they're doing. Yeah, so man. we on to the next topic now? All right, moving on. Let's do it, man. If you got the right warriors, man, you get that done. Easy. I feel you. I feel like there's no problem. With like, the listen, right thought juice? Even, the thought juice? You the don't, thought you, juice? We don't need anything like Ciroc that. Because we're all about juice. consent. I don't, Ciroc, apple, I don't need apple juice. I don't need any alcohol for anything. I'm all about consent. Do not have sex with girls after they drank alcohol. Consent don't Unless know. you're like in a relationship where you guys have Consent, that kind of understanding. Um, hey man, that's his life. Oh so what are we supposed to How do? Would you know? How would you know? Exactly. I'm not paying you, attention you, you, to you're that. You're paying attention oh, yeah. to the wrong thing. If I'm at the nude beach and my man got excited, so I, then he's getting rocking, and I'm happy no, for what, him. What if he's not? Go what get if he's rocking? What if guy. he's no, 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 no. Like, the number one lit. thing. You know that means if my man is excited, that means he's doing some fire shit. Let me ask you a question. I'm not even worried about that. I'm not concerned. I don't know. I never saw it. Let me I'm not even around let me, it. Let me ask like, you a question. Let me ask you a question. He, oh, your man's got excited? Oh, that was fire. Yo. Yeah, my man's got, yo, he killed that. Wow. I let know that. You, let me yeah, ask you a question. excited, man. You, you ask your man, yo, pass me a drink, and he turns around and he's excited. What do you say? I'm pass not giving you a drink. drink. Pass me the drink. Pass me the drink. Pass me the drink. My niggas will do that shit. That's some wacky pass shit. Pass me the drink, bro. My niggas is doing that shit. Pass me the drink, I don't even know none of that shit. If All you, this if is you, cut. If you All this it, is cut from the episode. <laughs> yeah. No, it's not. This yeah, is shit. This if is you shit. listen, if you this notice it, it's because there, you're bro. paying attention to the wrong things. You should never even know. I don't know what my Our yo. My nigga, I would never know what my niggas' women. meat would look like. Hey yo, what are you talking know. about? <laughs> I would never. Where look. are we at right now? <laughs> all right, yeah, next let's one, go. Next yeah, what's going on? And speaking of nudity and clothing and all that shit, is it possible? 
mm-hmm. for Shorty's sense of style to be so fire that it could make up for her like physical, uh, like maybe like attributes that she lacks to you. Yes. But her sense of style is so no. Like she puts it together. No. She's <laughs> flea, super flea. No. No. Vanity. It's my favorite sin. Yeah, man, I'm too. Yeah. She can, she, like, yeah, like I can't. if she I can't, can't dress herself, but she has a body that I want, yeah, I can get, I can, I can yeah. make her fresh. I can go to, yeah, I can yeah. get her Can free. you make her fresh? You're a yes. dude. Can I you can really make, make her cute. fresh? I can make her cute. Right? <laughs> can you really well, I mean, make her I don't as need a her. dude? She's not, she's, she's not, not like going. a dude. She's, Bro, she, I, got I can the make wardrobe. her cute. I got Fire J's and sweats and shit. No, we got the wardrobe. It's not That's not good enough. It's not good enough. I mean, it's good enough for me. She wasn't getting fresh before. And now she's looking cute that the way I like. So yeah, I'm good. You're gonna nah, want her to do I don't want to. I don't want to like kill the outfit with. You're gonna a, want her to do some Bob. dress shit and some like you know some fire. You're not. Th- you're telling me what I'm. I mean, like. Yeah, oh, you no, don't like, like shit like that. No, I'm saying there's a time and place for everything, and yeah, like it. Her with nobody and he get dressed. I don't care about your fashion yeah. like that, ma. Yeah. Okay, like yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. You know. What if she gets wild fly, baby? Nah, man. I mean, she doesn't have a body like I said, I can't do that it. I like. What the, what is, I don't know what, when you take them clothes off it's trash YSL fly uh, as hell yeah, yeah I'm not I don't care about name brands like that or oh, not even like name that. brand like no, everything no, 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 is no, that's so what you meant. that's what you no, no, that's what you meant. you meant clo- name brand perfectly. I don't care about that shit yeah, to mean? be honest with you, women you have don't the body that. that I want. I'm happy. Yeah, women don't need to have a. Um, so you'll pick a you'll pick a shorty with a banging body. Her fashion sense is in the. I'll pits. pick a shorty with a banging. I, like I, she dresses like Shy Ronnie. She can shop at Rainbow and just put on a fire tight dress just, and look mad good yes. for five cash. Yes. And <laughs> instead yes. of a hundred thousand dollar so. outfit with nobody. Yes. No, no, she dresses. I like, like those better. She dresses are, like the nigga from Diary of a Wimpy Kid. The nigga from there. That's how she. I don't know what that is. Like she dresses like a nerd. She just like Urkel. That's cool. It's cute. She, she has a body. That. She, she that has too. a body. It looks cute because nah. she has a body. Urkel was another low head horsepower. Horsepower. I'm just saying. You put it. Just make sure that the, the, the clothes fit and she has a body. It looks good. It looks good. It could be anything. She has a body. So it's fit right. It looks good. Worst fashion sense ever. Or yeah. Or the most amazing fashion sense in the yeah, world. I don't and care no about that. real body. Yeah. What do you want? I've I've given you for five minutes. I've been shitting on that for five minutes. What do you say? <laughs> Bleak, do you have an answer? Um, I'm asking you, G. Stop running. Yeah, stop running. <laughs> the shoes, the heels don't fall you off. You're talking man, all, all that running, trash. All You're taking SpongeBob SquarePants with Dior. Like she comes with Dior, but she has SpongeBob SquarePants body. Pancake butt. Good old wide flat butt. Like my <laughs> I don't objectify women. The real beauty of a woman is in her heart and in her mind frame and who she is. So if she had a nice fashion sense and she was super artistic and she could really... You see all these qualifiers, She could really... And she's artistic. She could really... Oh, my gosh. I wish that was made available to me. shit, G. Okay, hold on. Good way to walk out of this. Whoa, whoa. You're the man, G. That boy just moved walking out You just make up your... You ask us questions and you just change it up when when it's your time to make it. You just add wild stuff. My boy MJ will be proud of you. Can I finish my answer? No, why would we let you? Can I finish my answer? You're keep making stuff up as long as you go. Okay. A fire body... Whack clothes or the best fucking fits ever seen, ever known to man, and at nobody whatsoever. That's what you no, asked. Not us, the body right? that I like. Yeah, I'm gonna pick the body. Yes, we all will. We because we've got, yeah, we obviously I'm still, like I'm still, obvi- who asked sorry, this question? That was a waste of a I'm question. So sorry. A waste of a question? Yeah. yeah. That's a good question. No, it wasn't a good question. That's a good question. No, na- people, name a person who's picking the, the like outfit that. over the body. But what if, what if her personality is also... Because that's, yeah, mad, yeah. Cause that's, even, a lot that's of even materialistic on his face. Yeah, but a lot of people will still disagree with us. No. I'm sure, man. I'm pretty sure. All right. Dream girl. Okay, well, okay. This is the question. This is a scenario. Okay. Either or. Right? Okay. Either or. Let's go. Scenario, either or. Um... Scenario one. Is it right? obvious? Is it obvious either or? Yes. <laughs> but that's it's why obvious. I like them. Yes. It's, yes, it's obvious. It's obviously delicious. No, that's not always. No? All right. To be. You either get your dream 
girl, mm-hmm. dream girl in every way. She's beautiful. <coughs> she has. I already have my dream girl. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get it. That was smooth. I like how you did that. Hell yeah. I respect that. I mean, all right. That's how you treat a lady, guys. Um, you either get your dream girl in another world, another reality. Mm-hmm. This is just a hypothetical question. You get your dream girl, right? But you'll always be on some struggle shit. You'll never have a solid job. It'll just be in and out of. Sometimes you have money, sometimes you don't. You never have a solid job. Okay. Or scenario two, you get your dream job all, psh, bro, you're just having fun and getting paid billies, but you'll never have a stable fire shorty. It's always whack. Even if she's fire, she's the most grimiest cutthroat bitch. Yeah, clearly. Like, everything the, is trash. I mean, uh, the first one. Excuse me. The first one, when it comes to. Uh, it's like, yeah, it's the either the or. It's like loved. And fucking broke or, like, lonely and rich as shit? I mean, yeah, like, I don't want to be rich if my people's ain't rich with me. Let me, let me ask you guys, because are, are we just asking me all these questions? Like, Every, everybody the answers every single question. Did, y'all, didn't answer just the, y'all just didn't answer the question. Y'all were talking about moving on. No, we're not. We just, I was just waiting for him to give it to, like, you know, to make the transition. Yeah, so, no. you, Bleak, dream girl, like... Everything you wanted a woman, she got papers, she whatever you like. Yeah. And, well, but your your work situation is shaky at best. Yeah. At your best, it's trash. Well, first of all, you gotta know if first of all you gotta like under- you got a job, but it's trash. If it's one thing rappers taught us is if you don't got money, you're not keeping your dream girl. So I mean, ra- listening to rappers so, is one of the dumbest the things jump, in the world. Of that listening status, to rappers yeah, I, d- I don't trust rappers. Like I don't, I don't go with. Well, them. yeah, well, I trust the status, and the status says don't if trust, you ain't got the guap, the you're not keeping the dream. The scenario is you get the dream but girl, you stay with her, games. you stay with her forever, and your money situation is trash, or you get your job and you're always going to be rich and paid, but this and is- you'll never have a solid or good. Relationship, it's but, a personal relationship. But that's with a what I'm gonna. That's so what I'm saying. Or a male, whatever. There's you like. rules to that. Even though the status, that's what I'm saying. The status is that. Even though that's the rule, you gotta have the paper. So you cannot have a dream job and have it with. Like no, if you don't have the guap, you're not getting the dream girl. But the I'm dream giving girl you the is sin- not staying with the dude with the without the guap. <laughs> it's not happening. I feel you. I feel you. So I can't fathom it. Yeah, like it can't so be you real. Need the, you it need can't the be dream real. job. You need the dream job for the dream woman. I, uh, dream woman. I mean, that's just how it is. Yo, I feel like I would pick the love. I feel like that's my, the love. My ego is is intact enough. And listen, bro, there's some shit that you could push my buttons. But like, if she, I've I've been in relationships where Shorty makes more money than me. She's still not gonna talk crazy to me because I'm still a man. There's some shit you're not going to say to me. And if you say that to me, then we're not, you know what I mean? That's not a situation I'm in. So mm-hmm. I'm picking the love, but I'm, I am like the love shit. That's just me. Right. You know what I mean? It's, I know a lot of niggas will pick the bread. I get it. Security. I get it. It's but the only way to keep If you have nobody so to share it with, it gets crazy. Want. That's all yeah, but you'll have women. Security. But for the sake of the scenario, those women are always going to be cutthroat. They'll never love you for you. They'll just love you for your money, and it'll always be wacky. It can't. No, it's not cutthroat. It's just it's just the, what you bring to the table. It's you have so much money, they can never really look at you as a person. They're just looking no, at your value. because that money, you bring security. And that's what they want. Okay, my brain hurts. Next one. Go. Um, my brain hurts? What you mean your brain hurts? There's no way out of it. It's a paradox, then. The way you, the way you answer it. It's, oh, yeah? Yeah, it's, you got it. Like, oh, there's no way out. Well, that's just how I... I feel you. Like That's how I see it, man. Yeah. You got to have the money and, yeah. Sure. All right, so Christmas, the then Christmas you get the power. Then you get the uh. Remember that quick DJ Quick song? Yeah. Not long ago. DJ Quick, dated yourself. All right, so <laughs> since it's Christmas time, mm-hmm. talk yeah. about gift giving. I've had a lot of friends tell me over the years that they've had friends and associates tell me over the years that during the holiday season, when they have a, a relationship, their girlfriend or significant other never really hits the mark on the gift giving. Do you guys have any stories about gifts that just just missed the mark, just weren't, or like disappointing gifts? You don't have to mention any names, of course. We're not yeah. going to do that to anybody. But, you know, like, you go, gifts. it's Christmas time, you make sure you got her two pairs of these, 
that. You got the this and the that. Exactly the shit that she liked. Yeah. And then you got a pair of underwears. Oh. And not even the Polo Jones. Like not even. You got the Hanes. The straight FLMs. I Man, mean the Hanes. The, the sport the FTLs. Hanes. You got the sport Hanes? Wow, that's disrespectful. <laughs> that's OD. The the driving gloves. I've I've never experienced that, fortunately. Wow. You've driving always gotten good gifts. I, I, I'm, I'm, Over I, the years, you've never had a shorty give you, driving give gloves? you the, the drawn card, like I were like eight years old type no, shit. No, no, no. It's like always, I wrote in it, be, oh, the big ass card with mad writings been, in it. It's always been something from the heart, or I've actually, like when they say, hey, what do you want? I tell them what I actually want. No big ugly but sweaters. Usually, yeah, no, none of that. But man, no fur, I've, no, I've actually never owned an ugly sweater in my life. No furry socks. Nah, you gotta own no. an ugly sweater, man. Ugly sweaters is cool. No blankets. No. No. No picture frames. No. I guess I'm a loser. No fire plants. Have you have you had any bad? Uh, <laughs> do, have you had you any got uh, a cactus bad uh, gift experiences? Huh? <laughs> have you had any bad <laughs> gift experiences? Bro, man. I don't like gifts anymore. I'm traumatized. So. But it's some of the no bad gifts, ones. No, nah, it's just, just be like out of nowhere. Like, it has nothing to do with anything. Like, yeah. get me a whole set of some fake ass shit. <laughs> like, what is this? I bought a cologne set. Like, yeah, like, what is it? You know what I'm saying? Like, what kind oh, of like, no dollar name? store? Like, what I've is got, this? I've got those gifts Why from, like, I wear this? I've got the dollar store. Like, like from, like, the, like the Incredibles. The I've got, aftershave. I've got those gifts from, like, aunts and uncles. Like, the, like, the... The soap. I got you the I got you the tie and the 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 handkerchief, the part that goes right here, and then the tie clip. Maybe like, great. No, I don't really wear suits. I don't even... Have you ever seen me in a suit? Why would you fuck? Why would you get... But wait, I mean... You can get expensive cologne. You can give expensive cologne. It doesn't have to be from the from the ninety nine cent store. You What's expensive I mean? cologne? How much is that? That ranges. That goes over the sixty. You know, you at the sixty dollar mark. But if you go to like cologne you know, is always a good gift for a man. A man will always accept a good bottle of cologne. Yeah. And always. and honestly, I, as I a man, so. I would also accept some underwears too. Like I, I think I was shitting on underwears, but it's just gotta be some good underwear. underwears. Yeah, but you, what you want? What I'll kind of underwear you I'll want? I'll take some boxers. What kind of underwears you want? I, I feel those. I feel those are like you want like, the Versace. Those are you want the like Versace? Like, I feel. I I like, I like the faux socks. I like socks oh. and underwear and undershirts. Those those uh, those just are like good socks. Those good are like underwear. those are like you know those are like get, get the socks. Or the... You add that on to like the, those aren't. That's not the main gift. Those are like the you know that's mm. like like the the add on gift. The add on. So she you can't make so? you, she can't make you a shirt airbrush like I've been blessed. I've been like with her face gifts. on it. Nah, I mean that could be an add on gift. No, that's the gift. No, I got I got it done. Oh, I appreciate it. Mm. Are you tight? Nah. Yeah, you are. Yeah, I'm tight. Everybody's tight. <laughs> hey, airbrush t shirt. Yeah, I'm I tight. Mean, I used to get tight when my aunt used to give me that shit when I was like eight. Like, why are you giving me oversized t shirts for? I'm not even this tall. I'm not a large yet. Like, what? You just grabbed it from <laughs> nah, the rack. Love. And you just it's love. It's love, though. They, it up and gave it to me? they give it to you because it's love. Nah, man. I can't have a grown woman also give me that shit at this age. That's crazy. I will be getting How do you know time. what's enough to give when it comes to your significant other when it comes to uh, if you give Christmas gifts? I feel like we ask this every year. Oh, we do? That's good, though. Like, yeah, man. Like, we ask this. How, how it grows, how we grow. It hasn't from changed. That. That's why we have to keep asking. Yeah. So, yeah, what do you, what's the range that you give for a decent relationship? Y'all been in there for over a year or so. Y'all are serious, pretty serious about each other. What is. A year? Get a pair of Uggs. Over two years. <laughs> two years. <laughs> Uggs again? <laughs> yeah, I feel you. That's like that's a good. Yeah, listen, shorties will always say yes to Uggs. Of course, fuck a solid that. pair of Uggs will do it every time. Right, you're back in the good graces. You're back in the game. Trust me, they'll love you the month of January and February. They'll love yeah, you. So two hundred dollar, three hundred dollar range, something yeah. like that. Something like that. Nothing too crazy. Yeah. Get our next jacket. You're not gonna get our Montclair. Um, if nah. that's what, I mean, if, I don't if got that's a in the price range. <laughs> I mean, you love her, right? Why Love don't cost a thing. Does she want a Montclair? No. Nah, like, if she doesn't ask for one, I'm not buying her one. If she doesn't, like, if she doesn't directly say, I, "I like that, I want that," I don't know what I mean. They be having the black faces on their uh, coats. Yeah, I don't they really mess with them. They I'm not, like, you might, you might. Oh, mess so you with got? Them. Yeah, you I don't stand against them. this. They did got you. Damn, they got some fires. What if they get you that she Kenneth Cole type. shit? You know what I mean? You get that at Marshalls, you dig? Uh, little Kenneth of Cole joint I'm Marshall's The Kenneth Cole She get you the Kenneth Cole Tommy. lotion Yeah the little Tommy What is, you what is your girl Tommy bubble 
What if for Christmas your girl bought you the big lotion, like a big lotion? Is it the as the gift? It don't yeah. matter. Like what if it's that hemp shit like from Lassa like, Town? Like some expensive ass like lotion. Lassatan. I'll take that. Baby, this lotion is eight hundred dollars. I'll take it. Um, I, I love gifts like that. I love gifts like that. Five. It moisturizes you. Moisturize me, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I don't want that. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's wow. Eight, it's eight hundred dollar lotion, babe. Yeah, yeah. bro. Spent. You're gonna say no. You're gonna wow. say you're not gonna accept that with a smile. I will <clears> accept that. I'm gonna be like. Cool. Yeah. $800 lotion. She, you know, if, if you bought me $800 lotion, you know that I'm going to be tight. <laughs> like, you know I, I, that about me. You know, like, why yeah, would spend I be... $800 on lotion for me? It's straight from France. I don't straight. Know where it's, it's from. It was... It's customized just for your skin. Yeah. It's light as air. Yeah. It, it hydrates you. Mm-hmm. It lasts Swag. for 12 hours how at long, a time. Yeah, the virgins last... made this. How long does it last? With me? their hands. 12 hours at a time. Every no, application. No, 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 no. I'm saying the... Eight hundred dollar lotion. How long is that supposed to it's last? A good, it's a strong tub. Maybe uh, three months. Oh yeah, yeah. It, it was done no, by virgins. Right. Hence, never touched anything else but the machinery to make your lotion. Yeah, I'm, I'll $800. pass. Eight hundred dollars. You're not gonna tell her you pass. You're gonna take it with a smile. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take it and just eat that. Yes, yes, yes. That's yes, a fire yes. lotion. <laughs> <laughs> like Stefan Marbury. A Vaseline. Can yeah, you re-gift it and yeah. just give it away? I mean, it's eight hundred dollars. What do you mean? It's eight hundred dollars, though. So what? You put it on eBay? Yeah. And send it for twelve hundred. She's gonna be tight. Where your lotion go? Damn, baby, I dropped that shit. Yo, baby, you know that shit fell out the fucking window. Yeah. <laughs> I dropped it. My bad. I in, Oops. Uh, I, put I put it, it on the window by mistake. And it fell. sold it on StockX oh, for nine hundred. Damn. I got a hundred from it. That's a free, that's a free nine hundred. Nah, I take a lotion. Anytime. Then I buy use that to get the fucking uh, the rookie of the years or the band or the uh, the band Jordan joints. The band Jordans. Yeah, I like those shits. Anyway, guys, anything else you gotta say? I got a question uh, from my uh, from yeah, your asshole. Um, go ahead, let's do it. Let's go live. You got a yeah. question? You got a question, yeah. Crump? Oh, yeah. you got a viewer's question, Crump? Go yeah. ahead, Crump. Let's um, get it. This, 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 Why? This, a view, uh, I have What's a viewer question. A viewer question asked the group, the Blunt Exchange, mm. are you down with men in rap wearing nail polish and having purses? This is what the question is. Oh, like, well, you know, rappers are rock stars. And this is, you know. Just, are rappers rock stars? I think so. I think. Or do rappers, w- some rappers want to be rock stars? Oh, wow. That's different. <laughs> And it, What's or a rock a, star? Or is there a subset of rap that could be rock star rap? What's a rock star? Man, man, if you could swag it, swag it. What's a rock star? I, like yes. you could swag that I need kind to of know what the, a rock star to, is. You want me to look it up? You want me to look it up? I just need to know what a rock star is so I can answer this question. Okay, I'll look up rock star. Rock well, star. Maybe I'm rock wrong. Rock and Rock star. Yeah, I'm going to look I'm up rock star. For, for, for putting that together, those two and two rock star and that kind of style. That's a universal style because in the in the... In the reggaeton. Like a rocker style, shit. right? Niggas rock star, all the a time. famous, Conejo Malo a famous nails all the time. and successful singer or performer of rock music. Yeah. A person treated as a celebrity, especially in inspiring fanatical admiration. Okay. Yeah. Inspiring fanatical admiration. That's a sub. That's a sub okay. uh, I, I think that's the definition that we're no, talking That about. sense of style shouldn't be, shouldn't be uh, mixed with that. Yeah. I so, yeah. That. No, I mean, I, I, I also feel that the people that might might subscribe to the rock star lifestyle yeah. that the, the 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 viewer asked does have elements of rock music in their rap yeah if we look at if we look at some of the acts that that might uh well I'm not going to talk about the purses per se but like the nail polish painting of their nails they their music does have some elements of rock in it how do you feel about uh men painting their nails i think that's the question i don't have a problem I mean, I don't, I don't, I personally don't, I wouldn't paint my nails, but. If I mean, you looked, if I painted my nails, how would you feel? I mean, I, I wouldn't feel any way if you painted your nails, personally. I wouldn't. Yeah, you're I not me. Would you paint you, your nails? No, I wouldn't paint would my nails. Would you paint your nails? Um, I don't think so, but. You're leaving it open. If I ever choose to do it, I'll probably, you know, I'll do it. Are you, are you, how do you feel about men that paint their nails or rappers that paint their nails? Hmm. 
I don't judge niggas' style, bro. Like, some niggas can pull shit off that I can't pull off. Yeah. You're certain shit I'm not down with, but painting the nails is not a, a, a automatic hard no for me. For yourself or other people? I'm talking about other somebody okay. else. Okay. Like, like some all black nails? Uh, I get if you're on some goth, like, evil shit, like, that's your shtick. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what I mean? That's your, like... I get it. You're a performer. Mm-hmm. Like, I get it. I have, I know people that have like, like dudes, like, you know, cause sometimes, you know, you go get your nails done, you get the gloss. Right. You know yeah. I mean? They'll put like something on one of their fingers. Just oh, for real? Like what? Like a little like, like a fucking symbol, like some black shit. Uh-huh. You know yeah. I, mean? I got you. Like an Africa or some shit or like a something, like some cool shit, like a little kid, uh-huh. like a sticker right there. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm like, is that? I mean, I wouldn't I'm not, I that. don't give a fuck. Like, right, you know? right, that's. That's painting your nails, right? No. But now if it's like, oh, that's not. <laughs> but if it's like rainbow no, colors not. and yeah, glittery and nails. it's like coffin or like, yeah. yeah, you know, like. Coffin? Like, you know, like it's shaped, like you got some, what do they call Claws? it? Claws? you put the shit on top of it? I don't know. Acrylic, what's the? What's I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't know. This shit, this shit costs, you know, when she asks you for the bread every. Just, she just tells me no, she what? Gonna, what's what's it called? Done. Okay. All right. Listen, man. Um, yeah, but fuck it. I don't have a problem with it. So what about the purses part? Ooh. What's a purse? Uh, I don't know. Because uh, you're crazy. Here we go. The, that's what the... That's what the that, here you we correct go with the, the, man correct purse. the viewer. That's what the viewer says. I don't the know what a purse. purse is, but if it's a purse, like a woman's purse, What's then a I'm not purse? really down with that. Uh-huh. I don't wear women's purses. I don't understand. What about a, I, think, I guess what about a man's carry-all? Is it, is it a cold immerse? Yeah, it's a Merce. Oh, it's a Merce? Oh. It's a Merce. So I wasn't going to go out there and call it that. I think I would I go bag by bag. I feel like, man, like it's bag by bag basis. I can basis. swag a Merce. So do you, do you, are there any it's artists that you, 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 you approve of their bag usage? Bag. Let because you said artists particularly. Fuck it. So I guess some of the artists that I guess paint their nails are like the, the I know R.I.P. Juice World. Um, Juice some World, of those. great, great artists. Um... Uh, Lil Uzi, I feel like he's a great like artist. Yes. Nails. I don't judge him for his nails or his Gu- attire. I don't know if Gunna has also. Or, I mean, I guess those are, and those are the people that I guess also talk about bags in their in their in their music and and have them. So, but yeah, that's that. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not a really. I don't wear a bag. If I have a bag, it's a backpack or a knapsack. Do you consider? Did you do you consider? What do you consider when uh, the ki- the Man kids bags. who have the like those uh, fanny packs that now wear over their shoulders? Do you consider that to be the same? I like, get, do you I feel get that's it. in the same kind no, of realm look, of the? Uh, I don't judge that shit. Of, like, no, no. Do you feel that's in the same realm of the like a rapper who might have a bigger bag, like like Gunna, how he s- stays with like duffels and, yeah. and whatnot? I, I feel like most of it is comfortable, like. If you try them on and you actually wear them for a while, you'd be like, oh, this shit is comfortable to have access to something right here. So, in that I part, feel it. I, I used to love the North Face, like, yeah. fanny pack. That's my oh, you're shit. dating yourself. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. That shit is fire. Yeah, I've done I, it myself. Are they bringing that back to Supreme? I don't know. Even recently. Yeah, right? The fanny pack. That shit is fire, bro. Like, that's, a, that's a definite cop. Go get that. That shit is fire. And save one for me if you get an extra one. Yeah. Um... Yeah, so I don't give a, I don't give a fuck about those bags, and you know I'm from I'm from I'm Jamaican, like so like, niggas be having those little bags. Like, yeah, they've been had that man. shit. That this shit nothing. is easy access to everything. Do we even talk about anything? No, nothing at all, right? No, yes okay. we did. <laughs> we'll try to do. We'll definitely try to do better next week. We are. Um, we always do, man. What is this? Merry fucking Christmas. Merry uh, fucking uh, Christmas. Give good gifts. Thank you for. What saying else did it. we learn today? Give good gifts. Yes. If you have an open relationship. Make sure you know the parameters. Yes. Uh, a good body is a good body. And no and matter if, what clothes. No matter no what matter kind what of clothes, clothes you have on. Yes. You're not a guy. Guys have to worry about that. Yes. Guys can't just go to the male rainbow and get fresh for five cash. Nope. Is there, wait, what's the male you rainbow? Can't. Who knows? I don't know. H&M is the male rainbow? Nah. I don't man. know. Sheesh. I don't think so. Bleak, fashion guru, talk to me. Yeah. White tees do not rock anymore, guys. Do not yeah. do that. Uh, if you have a white tee, it has tees. to be fitted to you. No more big white tees. Which what? Fitted no to more you laffy the taffy. D4L. Wait, wait. This week is the last episode in the month, or it's over by this? The time La- last over. episode of the year. No, the next week is the last episode of the year. You sure? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, All right. right so they, next week, a couple days before, we'll actually do the awards. 
Woo! DJ Wavy Seal, what's up with the uh, Wavy nah, Seal mix? Nah, Talk to me. Mean, yeah. I'm not going to play the song. I'm what's going gonna, on with the Wavy Seal mix? Don't you have a new mix? I was listening about to it the music. other day. Yeah, I do have. I have a couple mixes. Facts, it's true. Where, where they can find them? On SoundCloud. D DJ J. Wavy Seal at SoundCloud.com. That has the Afro, music, Afro Sunday. Afro Sunday mix. It's amazing. I, I love Afro, Afro music. Yeah, listen, it's amazing. Afro beats is out of control it, right now. OD. Out of control. Get with it. And of course, I got the Spanish joint. Hoy se bebe. Hoy se bebe. Hoy se bebe. Hoy se bebe. So where we find that again? One more time? DJ, DJ. Wavy Seal. SoundCloud. Wavy. DJ Wavy Seal. Yeah, All man. All right, guys. It's old school. Let's get the fuck out of here because I'm chopped. I'm baked. Chopped. I'm uh, high uh, as fuck. Uh, uh, Thank uh, you for pulling up. Rolling, rolling up, up, lighting up, up, keeping it blunt with us. Merry yeah. Crema. Hope you got anything to say on the way Merry out? Merry yeah, Keep it blunt, yo. yo. That's it? Just keep, keep it blunt? It. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Um, safe travels. Uh, know the reason for the season. Yes. It's not about just Please gifts. Do. It's about family and, you know, yeah, man. life. And, you Fuck know, all that. Love. So Fuck all that material enjoy shit. Enjoy yourselves. Uh, don't good. drink and drive. Drink and drive. Yes. That's good advice. Man, that's what I didn't do it. That's good. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, man. So, yeah. Same thing, man. Merry Christmas. Enjoy your holidays. Don't do something I wouldn't do. Um, Yeah, that's about it. Cash in your tickets. Cash in your tickets because it's Christmas. You get the bonus. <laughs> <laughs> Christmas bonus. Huh? Hey. That? Little stocking stuff, huh? Yeah, man. I got some things right. worked well, out. Well, thank you guys for coming once again. You don't got to tell them something? You don't want to say nothing for the holidays? What you got to say, man? Come on, G. Let them know, man. Give them. No, no. Nah, they already know. We talk to them every day, man. Uh -huh. we just, we're just really grateful. We, we, we got some stats the other day. Oh, man. Yes, oh, we got some emails, you, man, and we're like really uh, grateful and appreciative of all the support you've given us this year. Uh, what, like over ten thousand mm. new views, and we've been we've yeah. going for like eight months. We're giving away yeah. the Henny book bag next we week. We still have the Henny book bag, so it's, that's getting it's, given it's away. Fine, it's fine. We're finalizing thank you, thank it. You, thank you. We're, we're looking through. We're giving the exactly. We're gonna choose our winner and announce them. Announce the winner on next episode. So on episode twenty six. Yeah, episode twenty six. Um, but you know, thank you once again. We're really grateful. We're trying to get a lot more subscribers to get to the place where we need to get to. We have Subscribe. some new stuff. We have some new content coming out. Right. Yes. Um, thank Shit. you for coming through. Woo, you know, woo, woo, uh, woo, woo. Blake, on the way out. Anything yep. else? That's it. I'm good, man. <laughs>